They put on this show that they're bitter rivalries, you know, villains, and they really don't like each other. But behind closed doors, they buddy up for a drink and make deals. Both the Republican and Democratic parties are owned by the same global elites. And on issues that matter to those global elites, they act as one. They've wrapped themselves in the American flag, and they've talked about preserving American heritage and principles, and all the while, they're working to merge us into a new world order where our sovereignty will be destroyed, we'll lose all connection with our American heritage. Every time in history when uh, the government was given the power or a group of banks in conjunction with the government was given the power to expand the money supply at will, those economic systems always wound up in crisis and always collapsed. So there's no reason to believe that the United States was given some kind of a get-out-of-jail-free card, an exemption from the processes of history. We've seen the limitations on government whittled away. We have seen this erosion to the point where today it seems like nobody does care. And right now in Washington, D.C., we have seen a fall of the republic.